Well, at least it's not snowing. I hate snow. 20 years ago, I was a sales manager. Well, about 20 years ago. I was at a small Chevy store in Detroit. It had been snowing for days. We hadn't seen a customer in three days. A customer came out onto the lot. It was a miracle. It was a Christmas miracle. And so I asked the salespeople to go out and handle that customer. And nobody wanted to go out. It was five degrees outside. And uh, they figured the customer wasn't very serious anyways. I was furious. I was a young sales manager. It was my first job being a sales manager. And I couldn't get anybody to cooperate. I said, somebody get out there and handle that customer. They're like, boss, it's freezing. It's snowing. I'm not going out there. I'm like, that does it. I'm going myself. And if I sell that customer a car, you're all fired when I get back. And they all went, <laughs> I couldn't believe I remember that to this day, this guy with this red mustache going <laughs> When I said I was going to fire him if he didn't go out there. But anyways, alright, let's get crazy. I'm going to go out there. So I get out there, the wind's blowing sideways. It's five degrees, I'm freezing, I'm regretting the fact I even went out there. But these customers are looking at these white mounds that we had out there full of snow, trying to guess what model it was underneath all that snow. Because you couldn't even tell what kind of car it was. So I said, howdy folks, how you doing? What can I help you with? They said, they're looking for a Camaro. I was like, I'm thinking to myself, a Camaro in the middle of winter of Detroit. It's five degrees out and they honestly are looking at a Camaro. Two wheel drive, rear wheel drive. That thing's not gonna do anything in the snow, but glad to meet you. All right, let's see, what color are you looking for? Michigan State green, they said. Green, okay, all right. And they go, I only wanna look at a green Camaro. No problem, all right, let me get my broom. So I brought out all these utensils, I get the broom, I start brushing the snow off the car, and it takes a few seconds to, to get to see what color it is. Nope, that's blue. I don't wanna look at that. I wanna look at a green one. All right, let me move over to this next car, this next white mound. I get the broom, push off the snow. It's red, that's not the right color either. All right, let's go to the next one. It took me five cars I had to brush the snow off with the broom till I could figure out or find a green one that they like. So once we found the green one that they like, they said, great, let's take it for a test drive. Now the snowplow machine had just gone down through the parking lot and had basically fenced in all the cars with a white fence of snow that had been pushed in front of them. I had to get a shovel to move that just so I could get close physically to the car and start the de-icing process of putting my de-icer into the keyhole and trying to warm that up so I could eventually put the key into it. Once you've done that, then you can get inside the car. It's not over. The car, great, they want to take it for a test drive. Vroom, 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 after I'm done shoveling the snow. Vroom, 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 the tires keep spinning. There's no way we're getting out. Folks, I'm sorry you can't take a test drive, but trust me, it drives great. Okay, I think uh, we'll take it. Well, okay, come on inside then. Great, this is easier than I thought. After an hour and a half of freezing, I can't feel my nose, my feet, or my fingers anymore, but I abandoned the shovel, abandoned the de-icer, abandoned everything, leave it outside. Let's go inside, hurry, let's get some hot chocolate and take these clothes, these ridiculous jackets off. Get inside, set them down, get them a hot chocolate, get them a coffee. All right, let's apply for credit. Go through the arduous process of taking their credit, which of course we didn't have computers back then, so this was all done by hand. And then we get all the information, and then we call the bank. Snake eyes, bad credit. I have now spent three hours in the snow, total with these customers, and now found out that the whole thing was a waste. We couldn't test drive it anyways, and they have bad credit anyways. I look over at my staff, they're all laughing hysterically at me, how stupid I am and how smart they are. That's it, class dismissed. Everybody go home for Christmas. Happy holidays.